What we are here today for is to say thank you to the government of South Africa and also to celebrate and to envision a world where the human family and human dignity are respected once again. In recognition and gratitude of South Africa's unwavering dedication to upholding international law and safeguarding Palestinian human rights. I grew up an apartheid, and I can tell you that I've never seen anything close to this. Of so many children and women being mowed down, how possible can we then remain indifferent when other people are suffering? What South Africa is doing is leading the world in holding ourselves accountable to international humanitarian law. Without real action towards international law, they remain empty. The genocide taking place now only underscores how vital the struggle is. Their hope is to annihilate. Our mission is the same as it was in South Africa, end apartheid and liberate the world from the last remnants of colonialism in religious ethno-nationalism. International solidarity is critically important. We do have a moral obligation to do the little bit that we can. From our ancestors who endured pogroms and genocide, we have learned to persist. And we are determined to persist until Palestine is free. Seeing him enveloped in this tree, it's almost like seeing him standing behind an old ancestor. Being able to receive olive oil and income uh, from these trees thousands of years after they were planted, it's the greatest manifestation of indigeneity, of love, of wisdom, and it's a testament to our connection to the land. We are united in the belief that when we say never again, it must include Palestinians. International solidarity changed attitudes of governments. That is how powerful the, 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 the public is. Solidarity is more than a word, it's more than a promise, it can be an action. When I say free Palestine, I look towards South Africa for hope. Palestine has always existed and it will, inshallah, God willing, it will be free again. As the work of Nelson Mandela illustrates to all of us, truth and justice will prevail once again.